Hello and welcome to Spotless. Uh, this has been in my inbox for like 10 days. Uh, 11 days, maybe. To, and now I've finally gotten around to it to be able to play it. So I did read through like the, the initial story and stuff like that. And basically, I'm going to go and clean the heck out of some stuff. You know, uh, spider webs and whatnot. And occasionally there's going to be some other things like these little guys. Uh, dust bunnies and... Um, you know, we don't want to, we don't want to fight those guys. Well, I mean, we have to, but I mean, like, they will eat us if we don't kill them. Oh, man, am I out of, am, I'm out of juice. Put a trap down, see if that does anything. Uh, I think I'm out of traps, too. Oh, okay, well, I guess we're, uh, just gonna come through and do our best. Oh, I didn't know I could, like, hurt them with my, um, cleaning brush. I really, uh, like the, uh, the whole Game Boy-esque aspect to it. I, I grew up with it, you know, I, I did have a Game Boy, uh, never had a Game Boy Color. Well, I did. I just, um, not until I was an adult, so it doesn't really count, I guess. But, um, yeah, I, I really enjoyed having the Game Boy. I got to play, like, all kind of stuff on, like, road trips, uh, which was pretty cool. And, um, uh, you know, when it was my first time really figuring out what to do here, so, uh, overall, rather dissatisfied. Ah, but we got a silver sponge. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Seven dollars. All right. Um, I wonder if we could um, cash out for now. Let's see what happens with our upgrades. See if we can get something. General upgrades. Everything seems to be locked except for this stuff, which is really expensive. It's kind of how everything always seems to be. Laundromat. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm a big fan of, like, cleaning games. Like, I mean, it seems, like, kind of weird, I suppose, to be, like, that's one of my favorite genres. I think it's just something about, like, it's, uh, just, it feels kind of relaxing. It's typically relatively wholesome. I, I don't know. I don't even really like to clean in real life, but in video game form, ah, yeah, man, it's, it's just, I don't know. It's something about it. It's just super enjoyable. Um... And, uh, this is just really cool. Like, I just... I don't know that I've seen... a game like this that, um, you know... pulls off this aesthetic. Everybody's so focused on trying to make everything look so fancy and realistic and... you know, bloods everywhere, uh, crime scene cleaners and whatnot. But this is just, um... I don't know, it's really impressive to do... I think this art style, because, you know, we have a limited color palette, and yet there's so much put into what we're seeing. Uh, we may not get a hundred percent, but I feel like, um... At 90% it's not bad. Oh, well, we got uh, neither satisfied nor dissatisfied, so that seems like it's pretty good. Awkwardly mediocre. I don't really think it's really that mediocre. We only earned $7. Wow, that's lame sauce. Um, we will continue. This only does it for the shift, but this seems like it's forever. Uh, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna do that. It honestly does seem like uh, the thing that you're gonna wanna do is try to um, 
kind of keep going as, as often as uh, possible because the more you go, the potentially the more you earn. Damn, this is what I think. I don't know. We'll see. This, um, uh, this may not, uh, work out. There's, like, a whole lot of these little dust bunnies. Even if I do survive, I don't think, um... Uh, okay. Well, never mind. I was gonna say, even if I do survive, I don't think I'm gonna, like, um, be able to do another floor. I mean, I don't know, 16 out of 20 health isn't that bad. Yeah, they're still not that happy about it. We got the stoop sponges, though. That's still uh, kind of good. We got $15. 20% overtime bonus. Ah, you know what? Whatever. Let's... Let's do it. May not be, like, a good idea, but... I said re restore 10 health, and I had 12, and we're only at 16. Oh, I've been bamboozled. to be like a much you know easier location to like clean like some upgrades that are going to like make it to where I can uh, move faster and maybe you know I don't know increase the percentage of what's cleaned as we clean if that is a thing because it definitely sucks to get like you know in the 90% uh, cleanliness and they're still not completely satisfied that, like, that seems so weird. Uh, I'll keep going. Instant Cure for Despair, which it seems like I have, right? But we'll do this instead. Uh, I don't actually know what the... What the Despair actually did. Um, but, I don't know. Thank you. 
Oh, we were so close. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh my god, I did it. I got 100%. Uh, but they're still not satisfied. Like, I mean, I, what is it these people really want from me? Yeah, I mean, the next one I'm probably gonna have to go back. I feel like I only have so much cash, or not cash, but um, health. And if I keep running into enemies that I'm, you know, are um, gonna like injure me, that's gonna put me in a situation where I could die. And then we can't clean anything. And I'm here to make everything absolutely spotless. It is nice that some of these things, um, will give you a higher percentage. So it kind of, like, it kind of makes sense to, like, try to look for things that are, um, going to give you more of a percentage if you can. I mean, I am just going for everything. I mean, I, when I think of spotless, I, I think of, like, really trying to get, like, everything, not just, not just the big stuff. But, yeah, this one's not going to go well. I mean, 82% is not that bad. going. Uh, let's see, I can heal my HP again by 10. I, I mean, I don't know that, I mean, I feel like maybe that's, I should have just held on to them, because it definitely feels like, you know, the best thing to do is save those for the upgrades that seem like they're going to be kind of permanent in nature. The dust bunnies and other critters, uh, those give you a bit more cleanliness stuff, so it's definitely worth going after them. so close. Oh my god, they're satisfied. That is amazing. Alright, we have three silver sponges. We got $55. Uh, heal all HP. Nah, 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 nah. Eh. That sounds like a good, um, good choice. I definitely want to have, like, something that's, um, I guess, like, a better cleaning capabilities of my brush. Is this really good for killing? Or, not, I shouldn't say killing, but I mean, that's totally what's happening. We're killing the dust bunnies and dust creatures. But, uh, you know, the more effective it is, you know, the better things will be for us. And by us, I mean the company, you know? I, um, 
I've never really been considered a company man. Like, I always got in trouble when I was in the military because my um, allegiance or my um, my focus uh, was always on the people that I was in charge of as opposed to everyone else. Uh, I think my favorite reason for not getting promoted once was because I wasn't a company man. Um... Like, it was really disappointing to hear that. They were like, I was like, oh, I, I didn't get, I didn't get the promotion recommendation. Well, why? And they're like, well, you're not, you're not really a company man. Like, you don't have the bosses back. You're, um, you know, you're, you're always going to do stuff for uh, the other, other people. And, uh, it's not what we want. And it's like, oh, well then. Now oh, you're just killing it, man. <clears throat> uh, you know what? I don't think any of these are necessary. I do feel like I need to go back and actually start trying to buy some upgrades and stuff so that I can have uh, more options. But at the same time, it does seem like a good idea to try to get as much cash as possible. Uh, and the best way to do that is to um, try to, like, you know do a lot of these things. Ooh, we unlocked Weed Killer. Sweet. Not sure uh, exactly what that would be used for when you're cleaning a building, but hey, you know, what do I know about cleaning stuff? I'm not a janitor. Funnily enough, though, um, <laughs> I, try, I did apply for, like, some custodial work just because, you know, it's like I'm looking for work uh, so I can buy more indie games and stuff, which seems like it's such a weird thing when you, like, say it out loud. Um, I'm just, I'm kind of fortunate that I, um, you know, I, I retired and stuff, so I, I do okay financially under most circumstances, but uh, the amount of indie games that are coming out, like, in a day-to-day -day basis, is just, it's too much for me to buy, like, every one that I'm interested in. It doesn't make sense, because, I mean, like, I, half the games that I, I buy, I, I don't have a chance to play until you know, who knows how long. Um, so it's not like I'm actually getting things done. It's not like I'm playing things at a pace that would actually warrant uh, me buying them, you know, at an early time. Like, I could just wait until a deep sale or something, but I don't know. Mm, let's see, none of those are good things that I want. So, But anyway, the, the point is, like, I applied for, like, a custodial job because I figured... I know how to clean bathrooms. I know how to do that. I can, I can do that. And then I, um, I got my rejection email. I was waiting for me this morning, and it said, uh, you know, unfortunately, we decided to go with somebody with more experience. Which, okay, I totally get. But I mean, they were paying like minimum wage. I mean, it's like, like, what do you, uh, what do you, what do you want from me, man? I mean, like, so that that's kind of been like my, my, um. Ah, experience here lately with trying to find a job. Everybody's like, no, 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 we want somebody with more experience, or you have too much experience, or, you know, we don't think that, um, you know, you're worth the price that, uh, you know, you're asking for, which is funny, because I'm only asking whatever it is they ask for. Like, I, I, it's, I don't really do the whole negotiation thing when it comes to, um, how much, you know, it costs to do it. It's just kind of like, I don't apply for a job uh, unless I'm willing to take whatever it is at the low end. And the reason for that is because, like, you know, like, if I'm just applying for a job, if I want a job, like, I, why would I apply for a job that, you know, there's a chance that they would pay me, you know, under what I want to be paid at as a minimum? Um, so... It's just kind of weird, man. The whole job search is weird. But it, where I was going with that is I guess I could use this on my resume. Uh, played spotless and cleaned a whole bunch of stuff. I was really good at it, kind of. Got sil silver sponges and all kinds of stuff. So, let's see. We're going to cash out. Oh, you know what? I, it looks like I was really wrong with how the cash works. Oh, uh, that's actually kind of disappointing. I, um... I thought I was getting, like, more cash uh, than I am, so that's, um... I thought, like, it wasn't, uh, I thought, like, each of those times I was going in, it was a different shift. 
Uh, but it appears that is um, not the case. And it seems like as we play, we unlock new things. Uh, but it's going to take longer for me to do this. Looter is definitely something I want. But for now... And that's 175, so it's, it's kind of easy. Uh, but for now, I think I want to upgrade... Um, the duster. I just, I feel like that would be a better, better choice. All right, we got all kinds of stuff. All right, uh, invitation to utilize the break room to something. Hey, hey, Spidey, how goes the cleaning? I guess I'm figuring it all out all right, though I've been running low on supplies when I clean back-to-back -back sites. All right, I guess now I forgot to mention to you that there's a break room back at Spotless HQ. Huh? That would have been good to know. What can I say? The boss lady is busy as heck. She can't remember everything when showing a new spotty the ropes of this noble profession. So that's where your pal Clean Jean comes in. Yeah, thanks. Could you show me where the break room is? I gotta get back to work soon. Absolutely. It's right down the hall there. Head in between sites to refill all your traps and sprays. Sweet. Uh, let's see. I just wanted someone to kick back and sip some pop with between sites. But also to compliment too. Uh, you're most welcome. Don't be a stranger. Just let me know if you ever want to, uh, we start a gun. That's funny. Such a hard worker. Indeed, I am. Mr. DePaolo, could I speak to you for a moment? Sure, Nan. Did I screw something up? No, not at all. In fact, I wanted to congratulate you on completing your probationary period as an independent contractor for Spotless Services. Probation? I didn't know I was on probation. I guess I screwed something up at some point. Oh, no. We just like to ease our new contractors in before adding the full responsibilities of the role to their assignments. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. Cool. Wait, does that mean I'm going to have even more to do now? Sure does, though it's on a request basis only. Before entering a site, you'll be made aware of any special requests the client has for you for how you clean their site. They might need you to minimize the damage you take on site so that their insurance rates don't go up, or they have a lot of dust bunnies they need you to completely wipe out. That sort of thing. Seems reasonable enough, but it might be tough to fill a client's request every single time. Hmm. There ain't no penalty for ignoring them, uh, but they get happier if we do it. Alright. Good to know. Alright, uh, don't need to training. It's kind of weird that the game has a link to the store itself. Oh, the Steam, Steam store. Okay, let's see. Don't use attack. What? Yeah, I'm not gonna do your thing. Like, like I don't know how you expect me to clean without attacking. Like, that's like a really weird request. I mean, I suppose I could have done it, but I mean, then I wouldn't be able to get anything clean, and I would prefer to do cleaning as opposed to um, whatever it is this person wants. I uh, know it's about client happiness, but the big thing is cleaning, getting this place to look really nice, earning that hard-earned cash that we'll get all $7. Yeah, so this, this brush is, um, I kind of regret the purchase, to be honest. Uh, without the knockback, uh, it definitely puts us at a bit of a, kind of like disadvantage. too happy about it but the inventory is restocked so that's good news oh so we can't do that um apparently because we are um despaired all right well that's good to know don't you spray that when i can pull off
like this is going to be another situation where I am not going to get a, a satisfied here. I do expect to get uh, of the bonus, though, because I didn't use the spray. Gotta take those little wins, you know? Ah, 71% okay. And they're satisfied, so that is happy news. We got three sponges. Only made 15 bucks, which is not quite enough. Uh, yeah, let's uh, take the brush. I'll, I'll take that too. I don't know that the brush actually made sense because I... No, because I'm using this. This is the... Um, whatever it is. Um... Like a duster thing. Oh, I didn't even... I, I didn't read because I wasn't paying attention. I was just in a hurry to get in here. Yeah, I'm gonna just start over. Um... This, uh, this duster is, it's, it's hot garbage, man. I mean, I guess it's kind of nice that it can, like, take on, um, it has a wider range of, uh, getting things, but it's just, it's ultimately not what I would consider worth it because it just doesn't do enough damage to enemies, so you just get kind of straight up hosed. Seventy percent is good enough. Oh man, dissatisfied. Oh, well, that's just an unhappy moment. Back to another shift. What do we get? Oh, good, we got the normal brush. Sweet. Don't use spray. Easy enough. Now, I'll see if I can do this uh, again and, and do it a little bit better. Yeah, see, that's, like, so much better, and, I mean, it would be different if I didn't have to worry about any enemies, but, yeah, you never know, like, there's, like, a whole bunch. Hello, kitty. like the uh, music to the game. I think this is going to be like one of the games. I, I don't know how it... I don't know if it runs on the Steam Deck. I didn't check that on the Steam page uh, because I was going to play this on PC but I might have to look. Uh, this is something I might be playing uh, next week on my plane trips or my plane ride. Just because, it, you know, it's a very, very easy game to jump into and play for like a short period of time if I want to. And it honestly feels like it would be just, I don't know, like a really, really good experience for that purpose. I don't know, I, I just enjoy like the, um, the rather chill vibes we have going on. And it's a really satisfying gameplay loop. Like, none of it's like overly difficult. I mean, I guess it's a little bit hard to like, you know, get these people to be happy about everything we're doing. It seems to definitely take a little bit of time to actually get there, but, uh... Overall, like, I mean, it's just... There's nothing overly difficult about it. There's nothing complicated. 
It's just get in here and start cleaning everything uh, to the best of your ability and uh, rake in that sweet, sweet monetary reward. I suppose it's a little bit weird that you can make a game that um, has you cleaning toilets and stuff and people enjoy it. Because I think that's like probably like one of the least favorite things that uh, anyone has. Like nobody really, I think, wants to clean a toilet because it's they can be kind of gross. I'm pretty bad at it. Like I, I think I, I think my girlfriend cleans our toilet more than I do. Sometimes I'm really good at it and I'll and I'll clean it uh, without asking or without her asking and. You know, and I, and I stay up top of it, and then other times, yeah, I just... I kind of wait way too long. Unfortunately, this is uh, likely to be another situation where... Dang, I messed up. And uh, they're dissatisfied because I took damage, whatever. Alright, you know, it's not my fault, man. Like, I mean, you know... I tried. I feel like, it seems like these purchases would only matter if I was actually using it. Um... I don't know that there is an option in changing... Uh... Oh. It looks like we might be able to change, actually, our inventory if we really wanted to. Um... And these look like they're more shift upgrades, which aren't really what I... what I want, so... Now, if I can get that duster to do uh, the same amount of damage, like if I can get it to do two damage um, from the get-go, I, I think it'll be worth having. Um, and I don't know what items that the enemies uh, might drop, so I'm not even sure if that one's a good purchase. I think that's like part of the problem when you have a game that uh, says there's unlocks, but you don't know what they are until you have done something in the game, and it may not necessarily be super clear on what it is you're supposed to do. Like, in this game's case, I, I don't know what I need to do to unlock some of the things, and it's fine. Like, I don't mind. I mean, I will figure it out eventually, uh, give it enough time put into it. But it does suck a little bit, uh, because, you know, not knowing what it is that I have to do means uh, it's a little bit more difficult to, you know, make those determinations as I play to do something that's going to actually um, result in unlocking a new ability or tool set or something like that. Whew, just, just barely. Four bucks, uh, thirty percent overtime bonus. Eh, that's good, good news. I really don't want the duster. I like it a little bit, but it's just—it's not worth it, man. So from what I've seen so far, like the. Um, Probably the best thing to do is hope that there are a bunch of uh, larger enemies because you will get a, a larger amount. Uh, cobwebs seem to be pretty useful. And of course, like any actual, like, I don't know, object uh, seems to be a pretty good choice as well.
Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make it to the hundred percent. And that's fine. Like I've I've got like the um the minimum damage down. Which I think is like the important part. Actually, things like took a turn for awesome there, and uh, things actually worked uh, really nice. Let's see, they're satisfied, which is um, you know good news. Spray bottle. I don't really use the spray bottle, so I'm just gonna keep saving up these sponges until um, I don't know something cool happens or something cool shows up. Oh, I didn't check to see if there was something uh, they wanted me to do. Uh, and now I stink. Uh, being stinky is apparently going to be very bad for our uh, goal here of, you know, cleaning up. Oh yeah, basically we're not gonna We're not gonna clean anything. Oh, that's super unfortunate. Yeah. Alright, well I mean I guess I rely too much on just the um the basic uh, attack of the brush. I just I don't know, I like it more than um everything else. Everything else just kinda seems less useful. And we can't swim, and going in the water, uh, I thought maybe it would um, kind of help with the cleanliness. Uh, turns out that was a bad choice. Oh good, I completed the client request. And I've opened, I've unlocked the Dustless Demon Jr., whatever that is. I mean, they're satisfied, so I'm not going to complain too much about it. We will keep going, because why not? Yeah, no more uh, stinky stink. Too bad we don't have anything for health. Uh, I would have liked to do something. Ah, oh, man, that's the second time that I just kind of was in such a rush to get into the uh, cleaning that um, I didn't read whatever it is that um, the client wants. I am not good at paying attention to that. And I've been playing this for 38 minutes. It's the kind of game that you could probably play for, um, you know, 20 minutes and make a video of it and say like, well, there you go, that's that's kind of the game. But you know what, honestly, it's a, just a really chill experience. I'm having a grand old time. Oh, this is a pity piggy bank and he drops cash. Well, what a, what a happy moment. Oh my gosh, 56 buckaroos. I'm taking it. Anyway, so the, the point is of what I'm saying is I'm just going to keep playing this and, um... Yeah, this video is just going to be long as heck because, um, that's what I want to do. I don't know, some people listen to me talk and ramble on and play video games for a long period of time. I don't know, I mean, maybe? I don't know. Maybe I'll make another video that's, uh, really short. Um... It's more of like a review video, I guess. I don't know. Maybe that makes sense. Uh... There was no like actual expectation of what uh, I would specifically cover, so I'm just gonna do what I'm doing. Mm, and once again, not a thing. I've been really disappointed with, uh, you know, like our our upgrade choices at the end of the levels. Uh, we're not getting anything cool.
And if, if one of my options isn't health for the next round, I, I feel like I'm probably going to have to give up again. I just, I don't want to risk actually dying. I, I don't know what happens. And I, I kind of don't want to find out. Oh, that is a... Uh, I need that the piggy bank. Piggy bank. Piggy bank makes everything worth it. Oh, it's gonna be pretty cool if we're gonna uh, have a much better odds of um, getting that every time. Because that basically gives me a really good chance of um, making a, a very large amount of cash to um, potentially actually uh, do pretty decent. So here's the downside, is like, I want to go to the next one and kind of see how things are going. I mean, like, I made almost $200, but I don't know if I have enough stuff. Oh, sweet. It was like impossible to know whether or not we were going to actually get more health. Um, no, no requests. So that's good news. You know, I wish cleaning in real life was as enjoyable as this was. I mean, like, I would, I would probably do it a little bit more, or I would do a better job at it. I'm really happy with the, uh, I don't know, just, just how the gameplay loop is. It's, I mean, it's very, very simple. Like, this is not a complicated game uh, whatsoever, but it's, um... It's just really charming with um, how it is. Uh, it's just... The little story bits that we've had so far are just kind of... They're kind of charming. They're a little bit whimsical. They're kind of funny. Um, did we get though? We guess we get like a whole bunch of money every time uh, the more you the more you go. We get 209 bucks. Let's go. Uh, nothing. Nothing worth it. Don't use attack. I, see, I don't understand that. I mean, it's like I could not use attack, but I mean, it just it seems like if you don't use attack, I mean, the only thing I would be doing is walking around and using a spray. It seems like something that I might be able to do, like, as time goes on, and I've made enough upgrades to where I can use more spray or something. But for now, I mean, I only have five spray. I got the three traps. It's just not enough to um, effectively clean anything. So it's just, that's going to be a client request that I, I just can't do. At least for now, because it seems like it would just be kind of boring to walk around and, uh, you know, avoid everything and maybe occasionally spray something and be like, oh look, look what I did. so many sponges, I feel like it just makes sense to kind of heal myself again. No request. Oh. 
I'm looking forward to unlocking some new locations. Uh, you know, the locations that I've been to are pretty cool. I do like them. But it definitely, you know, you start to notice that you're kind of going through the same places all the time. And um, I do want to see some new places. Uh, and I'm pretty sure that's going to be possible. Thank you for stopping, Piggy. I always thought it was weird then, you know, we do, like, piggy banks. Uh, like, there's nothing wrong with a piggy bank. A piggy bank is really cool. Uh, but uh, I, I myself, when I was growing up as a child, I had a um, custom-made post office box. I still remember the code for it. Uh, it was BCIJB, which is crazy that I remember that. And you might say, well, why would I just give away the combo to my custom-made post office box thing. Well, it's because I don't have it anymore. I got rid of it. Um, parts of it had broke, basically. Uh, and, you know, it just... It just didn't make sense anymore to have. Uh, also because I, I did, you know, I in today's world, you know, it's not very often that we actually have, I think, cash on us. Most of us uh, use credit cards, debit cards uh, to kind of get around our daily life or Finmo, PayPal, etc. Ah, $280. I want to get, like, more. Give me, like, $300. I'm curious to see, like, how much, um... Like, how, how high of a percentage it can go. I feel like it might be able to go up pretty high. Oh, well, I guess I wasn't supposed to spray, but I didn't read it uh, once again. Like I said, I'm doing a very bad job of actually just paying attention to what the client wants. guy. I don't know. It's like some kind of weird fish thing. Um, uh, unfortunately, it looks like this is probably going to be uh, the end of this run. I was doing such a good job, too, but not worth it to, like, risk death. Uh... I feel like I unlocked some stuff, so I, I think it's like a good idea to kind of go back. Alright, uh, the break room level one. This costs nothing, it's redeemed, um, so I don't need this. This has already been upgraded. This looks like it could be a good one. Uh, the broom and the mops potentially will be a good choice. Oh, uh, break room upgrade 2 gives us an HP heart. Good to know. See, I just I just don't know what this will do. Um, it says they'll drop items, but I don't know what kind of items. So I don't know if that would be a good choice or not. Right. I'm going to buy it because I, 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 I don't know gonna hope for the best. I'm gonna buy this broom. Um, looks like that's um, actually all we can buy, but we get more conversations. Alright, what's cracking, Gene? I must remember it's a clean Gene to you, new guy. I'm a bad. Hey, how'd you end up with a prestigious title anyway? Great secret. Okay, got it. Uh, got some to do with how I do with my clan feedback forms. Makes sense. Okay, I'll tell you, but only because we're pals. Blah, 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 blah. So if we find stuff, people will be happy, so we'll look for those as well. 
Seems like the more you play and the more we unlock stuff, the uh, more opportunities to potentially make some cash and stuff like that um, is kind of going into things, so... No, 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 let's go back. I'm, I'm still like, ah, I'm still, I'm still reading that. I just got like over, um, overzealous. like I'm doing a better job now that I've got like a better idea of um, kind of like what to look for. The big focus is definitely on, you know, larger objects and enemies. Obviously not all enemies are um, created the same. Ah, oh, you son of a gun. the other story bit so I am I'm going to um I'm, I'm done I'm just taking that seven bucks uh okay, I read about the client secrets I'm going to share with the clients is that I mentioned the offense to mention how pleased they are with your work well I would hope so because I'm doing an excellent job Oh, care packages. Ooh, very cool. Alright, we got new upgrades. I don't think I can actually afford much. Well, 125, it's a maybe. Care packages are actually unlocked. Care packages will appear in some sites. Um, that one I have. Uh, not a whole bunch of other... Per shift. That seems like a good idea. I'm gonna buy that. Secret finder, we've got oh, three choices are offered at uh, shift upgrades. Forbidden. Well, let's take that one too. Lots of good, um, uh, lots of good things this time. Treasure Finder, that's a good one. All kinds of good stuff this time. There's 114, is that what it said? 114? 114 upgrades, that's quite a bit. Don't use defense, uh, which means no, um, no dashing, which is unfortunate because that's uh, the fastest way to get around. But I do aim to please. Seems like there's uh, potentially some other choices. That we can get for defense. It's not always gonna be the dash. Um, I will say that the uh, the items um, you know, popping up for uh, doing some stuff is like a really good uh, upgrade choice. Like, it's not necessarily always going to have something good, but I mean, I've gotten two coins, two dollars. We got the um, speed increase that I kind of wasted because I took damage immediately after, but, you know, that's okay. Like, I mean, terrible things happen sometimes, and you just kind of keep, keep doing what you're doing.
And I got a health back. Oh, yeah. This is gonna be it. I will likely make this the last run for the video because, I mean, I, I'm already gonna go over an hour. Um, but it's, you know, it's, it's gonna, I feel like, give a... It gives a good example of kind of like what to expect from the game. And um, I, I always think it's like a positive thing when you play a game you don't want to put it down. I mean, people can always jump around uh, to try to find other stuff in the video. Uh, none of these are something I want. Oh, wait, hold on. Let's uh, use the reroll. Uh, we get one reroll per shift, from what I understand, but there's nothing good. Defeat all enemies? I guess that's where our focus lies. Sorry, Dust Bunny, but you have to go away. I have no idea how many enemies there actually are. I think that's like, you know, it's, I, I like that, um, you know, my customer request here is to kill all the enemies uh, because that is a pretty enjoyable experience, but it just, it's a little unfortunate because I have no idea how many enemies there are. So, you know, I'm just kind of guessing at what we're doing, you know, and I have to be careful. Like, do I clean too much? There's a good possibility I um, failed to deliver on the request. But it's like not my fault. Like I have no idea how many there are. This is probably the last guy. Oh, hold on. Site unlocked on the library. Oh, we are so close to getting 100%. So close. Um, yeah, so I'm lie success. Why would I lie about this? Um, yeah, there you go. I found a thing. You're very welcome. I wonder what happens if I don't, um, give up those things, I guess. Ah. Oh. So I was wrong about the reroll. I, I thought... It actually meant, because one, once per shift, I felt like, you know, going to, um, every time we go to one of these spots, that was a new shift, but I don't know why I thought that. I mean, like, I've, I, I've been paying attention in the whole thing about, like, you've earned this much money per shift. I should have known better. a better idea of how valuable these secrets are. Because there's not really a lot of info on it. I don't know what lying about it would do. I do think honesty is the uh, best of all options. Alright, we found a little cool chest uh, that would have some hearts in it. Could have been useful, but I've been doing an, an exceptional job with uh, not taking any damage. So. Not something I needed. Uh, I sure did. You can have this thing. Hmm. I mean, he's very satisfied. So, I mean, they're good news for me. Uh, you know what? Let's uh, let's buy that one. I feel like that's actually a good idea. And more spray. 
don't use attack. See, this one's one that I don't, I don't care for, man. It just, I'm not gonna do it. Like, it just doesn't make sense to me. Because, um, you know, it's just, I don't have an effective way, even with 10, dang, sprays, even with 10, um, even with 10 sprays, it's, it's not enough to play this in a way that, um, would make, um, playing in that manner, I guess, entertaining. Um, but I don't have a choice. I, I, I have to, like, I have to, like, go and spray everybody. I, or, not spray, but, um, use my brush, attack everybody. I do wish we could, um, walk into water to get the stink off. Like, I just... I feel like that would have made, you know, sense. No, but it doesn't. Like, it's like, no, 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 no. That's not how water... That's not how things work. But it does work that way. I mean, you could be super dirty and jump in water. And while it may not, like, completely remove the stink, you would smell better than you would if you um, just kept walking around on your own stink. Um, which, for anybody who's... If you've ever been, like, on a long hiking trip, you would you know, have a pretty good idea of what I'm talking about. Eh, dissatisfied. Whatever, I don't care. And, um, no anti-stink, because of course there's no anti-stink. Uh, I'm gonna take the broom, because I haven't used it yet. Beat all enemies, also something I imagine I can do. Let's, uh... Looks like it's gonna be a little bit slower, but it is a, a very effective attack, so... Big fan of the broom thus far. I don't know, maybe not. The uh, fact that it like pushes enemies so far back is a little bit on the negative side. But it is nice to have like um. I guess some range between me and the enemies. But the uh, delay is uh, not the delay, but the cooldown between the the. The attack is definitely something that um, leaves a little bit to be desired. I uh, think I might have got everybody. Come on. You know, I, I definitely got that due to the end, but apparently I didn't quite get it. Without this, um, man, I gotta get rid of this stink. Maybe if I if I had actually gone straight instead of like at a weird angle, uh, yes. But I have no idea what just dropped there. It was like some kind of um 
flask that could have been something of value. And increase speed. Not that it's going to do me much good. Oh, well. Unfortunate. Oh, I like the little Jaws poster. It must be really disappointing to have somebody come in and clean uh, your place that you want them to clean and for them to smell like absolute garbage. Uh, I'll take it. I don't actually need it, but... Still no deodorant, but we have to clean the refrigerator. That one's an easy task. Like in situations like this, it's just it's just kind of go and take care of the one thing they want you to. Um, I'm less inclined to really get any of the cleaning done um, right now because it's just... I, I, I don't know. I, I feel like the stink maybe shouldn't um, be so continuous. It just... It just... It sucks that it just, you know, hasn't gone away. Like... You know, it gives me that reason that I'm supposed to not get, um, you know, take damage and stuff, which I totally get. I totally understand. It's a, it's a good um, incentive to not get dirty, but it just, it's super unfortunate, man, because like it's, it puts you in a situation where the likelihood of you um, actually uh, being able to reach that 100% clean at a very, very low amount. Not to say that it's impossible, because as we can see, I mean, I got pretty close, 77%. And there's still a happy camper, so that's like the important part. And, uh, of course, they still do not have any deodorant. Don't use traps, not something I use too often, so... Oh, this is always the happy moment. The uh, pig, nothing else matters um, because I can get that gold. Man, it's like the only the one time that uh, they gave me like a whole bunch of goodies. But I will gladly take it. The more uh, money we have, the more we um, have a likelihood of buying some cool stuff. I think I'm actually going to lie about what I found this time. Actually, no, because it's still like only a 10% chance, probably. And uh, that just seems like a, an impossibility. I mean, I have greater odds with them um, talking to my girlfriend about what we're going to have for dinner. Um, she doesn't know what the options are. Uh, I say that it sounds weird, but like, I, you know, it's my turn to cook dinner. She made some enchiladas and they were absolutely delicious. Uh, we had those for two days uh, because, you know, leftovers are pretty cool, but they were delicious. I mean, I really, really liked them. And then, um, you know, uh, tonight I can either make like this really um, less than exciting poor man steak style thing that it's like hamburger though but you don't do make it into a Salisbury steak looking thing because I'm too lazy for that uh, but it's um, you know it's occasionally pretty delicious and or or we can have like a, a queso pizza from Aldi that I bought um, because I don't know. It looked delicious. It's got cheese on it. It's got a bunch of other things that you would expect to be on pizza. Um, and that also looked really good. So I picked up one of those when I went to the store. I was supposed to get um, 
gloves. I couldn't find any gloves. So what I got instead was um, some sour cream and a strawberry cake. You know, and you might say, those aren't anything like each other. But, uh, you know, if, you, if you've made it, like, to any point in time of this video, you would know that I really don't have any idea what I'm doing when it comes to cleaning. So to expect, to, expect me to find gloves, uh, it's probably unlikely. I also bought oat milk for her because she likes that. It's not that she's like one of those uh, yoga mat people or the, the vegans or, you know, somebody like that. She, you know, just prefers oat milk um, to regular milk. Because uh, she she doesn't like the you know the, the whole way they make milk you know it's just it's just kind of sad for the cows because they have to take the cow they have to you know, drain its blood and then and then filter it through like the the, the weird thing to, to turn it into to milk and it's just you know it's just rough on the cow to, to have to go through all that so she prefers oat milk because oat milk doesn't have like blood and so. So, I got her some oat milk to have a, uh, you know, try to be a, a pretty good dude. Uh, let's see. Instant cure for stink. Oh, thank goodness. Finally. Clean a refrigerator. Well, we got this. This might be the, um, the run that's gonna take us to, um, actually finding you know how how high up of a percentage we can get because so far it looks like we can get at least a hundred percent bonus which is definitely really really nice oh look at this some treasure uh, where's this fridge Buddy things, whatever you guys are. Where is, uh, where's, where's the fridge, man? I think that maybe it gave me a little bit of time. Alright, I, I mean, I really want to find the fridge, obviously. Woo! I didn't think I was going to find the fridge. Uh, it was looking um, rather unlikely. But I persevered and I got lucky. I still, I still, I, I just, I, I feel like something probably has to change in order for me to um, unlock something that actually would make sense to lie about that. Nah, th those don't seem like good ideas. Uh, I've got a bunch of sponges, so I will take that. It actually seems like these might be worth buying after all. Not that I need it, but yeah, see, look, and I now have like a new a new location. Request is to go swimming. I think it's kind of messed up. Do they not know that I? Maybe they don't know that I don't know how to swim. I do know how to swim in real life. I don't know that I could swim for like long enough to stay afloat um, to, to the point that I felt um, pretty good about, you know, being in the water for a long period of time. I guess like my major concern is, of course, uh, sharks. Like they live in the water and you you would think, you know, like, well, just go swim in a lake. You'll be safe there. Now, I, I've seen that movie where the people are in the lake and it's full of sharks. And um, it had, um, I don't think it had Casper Van Dien in it. It was a guy that like looked like him. Uh, but my point is, 
Um, if everything we see in Hollywood is true, then that means there's a good possibility that uh, there are lakes somewhere where sharks um, live. And thank you so much, Fish, for giving me the stink. Oh well, oh well. Maybe I can get lucky and um, get some more deodorant again. Wheat. Take minimal damage, that one's an easy... I like the ones that are like relatively easy as far as like um, the goal. You know, it's like, alright, well you just need me to kill everything or just not take damage. I can do that. Seems like they put like a lot more enemies in this one. Definitely not gonna hit 100%. Uh, whatever that thing is, like, I definitely didn't think it was um, an enemy. Come on, find something. And we unlocked a new place, the Lone Star Inn. Sweet, you know, this is like happy moments, man. I mean, I'm unlocking like all kinds of new stuff. One broom damage, absolutely. Uh, we'll take that one and this one. Like I said, I'm basically gonna just keep taking like everything now because it seems like that's um, a good way to unlock uh, further upgrades over time. And I'm pretty sure that's a floating shark. That is definitely a floating shark. Um, I know it's a floating shark because it has uh, sunglasses, just like a real-life shark. So far, so good. No damage, uh, no stinky stink. Uh, this part, I am not confident about. I tried to do that before. But it's, like, really difficult to, um, time it right to, um, not take damage. I, um, oh man, I, I did everything, but we didn't defeat all the enemies. It's not my fault. Uh, they, they, they jumped in the, I, I was cleaning. I'm too good of a cleaner to actually, um, do everything they wanted me to do. Uh, grants immunity for the shift. Uh, I feel like, um, I should, um, save up a little bit more. Don't use defense. Gotcha. I feel like you have to start a new shift in order to go to some of these locations, uh, that are being unlocked. Because I've unlocked, like, what, three or four places, uh, this run alone? Dragon burp? What is that? has been a super satisfying, super satisfying cleaning uh, utensil or tool or whatever. I'm really happy with it. 
You know, I have to say this is probably like one of those games that like I definitely um, had never heard of. I am incredibly satisfied with uh, the experience overall. Like it's just been really, really good. It might be that I just really like the chill experience of games at times, and I just, you know, sometimes it's just nice to chill and not have to worry about stuff, and uh, just just walk around and do stuff to feel satisfying. And I, I definitely do like that aspect when it comes to games, and I know that I do. Uh, but I definitely did not expect to go into this and have trouble putting it down. Like, it has just been like an incredible time sink. It just kind of like pulls me in. All right, let's lie and see what happens. Uh, all right, well, we lied and we failed. And we are at 421 bucks. Yep, uh, we're gonna keep going. I'm not using the brush. I don't think I need to do anything for it, uh, but I'm gonna do it because I feel like it might um, potentially have a benefit and We'll keep moving forward. Oh, the library. Denise Dickens. I'm not really sure. Like, there's this sound happening, and it just... Seems like, um... Like, it implies there's something happening somewhere that uh, might be on the, the more dangerous side. But I could be wrong. I don't know. It's so impossible to tell. one uh, but hey you know what they were satisfied and that's like the important part which I would have found like the the secret but no big deal uh, we unlocked something I'm not sure what it was ID pod level two um, I'm gonna I haven't really been using it but we're gonna take it defeat all enemies easy enough So one thing that, it, well, of the many things that I've experienced so far, like, um, I guess one of the benefits of uh, playing through some of these levels multiple times is uh, the setup of them seems to be kind of the same, and it seems like I, I'm having a fairly decent time of remembering where some items are and stuff like that, which I feel like will probably make it a little bit easier to... Um, you know, achieve certain things at times, like... I don't even think I got everybody. Uh, you can have that. Uh, I do want to keep trying to lie about that because I'm curious what will happen if I succeed with that. Um... Make it spotless. All right, that one's... Another, like, easier said than done, but... But we're definitely off to a good start. There's 
at all the um, enemies. Although, it does seem like we're um, not going at like the fastest pace. this company's uh, best cleaning place uh, ever. Our best cleaning person. I, I don't know. Janitor, uh, cleaner, spot lift, spot, spot, spot I don't know. Don't use defense. Gotcha. One of these times, though, I'm gonna, the 10% thing is gonna work out. Like, I'm, I'm gonna successfully lie about finding this um, stuff and actually have an idea of whether or not it's actually worth it to do that. Because I, I don't know what it, there wasn't anything in the, um, like, the story that unlocked that kind of tells you that it's a thing that happens. There was nothing that really, at least I don't think so, did I miss it? But I don't think there was anything that says, like, hey, if you um, hold on to it, you can kind of keep it for uh, later. Although, I guess um, it does say something about, like, um, it could potentially be used for um, for cash purposes. So I'm thinking uh, if I'm able to hold on to it, I might be able to sell it or something. So... one I uh, tried it oh no we lied and we uh, we won and we got the poker face upgrade whatever that does all right 190 percent yeah absolutely let's do this again uh, I still don't use the spray often enough I think to like warrant ever putting any upgrades into it but No traps. Well, that's easy. I don't do those anyway. I do think it's funny that we use the same cleaning supplies uh, on everything. I mean, how easy would life be if it was like, hey, I'm gonna go in sweep uh, the... <laughs> We go sweep some stuff. All right, cool. Um, and then it's like, I'm not gonna sweep some stuff. I'm I'm gonna clean the toilet with the broom, uh, and then you know clean out the floor in the kitchen or something. Uh, obviously, life's not so easy, but it works. I think, like, as far as, like, games that I've played, um, recently, uh, and I've played quite a few, but, uh, of games that I've played recently, I think this is gonna be easily one of my favorites. Because, I mean, like, I mean, it's, uh, I mean, this video, I said I would, you know, maybe, like, make an hour and stuff, um, and here we are, we're almost at two hours, uh, it's almost an hour and a half, you know what, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm... I'm legitimately going to keep going until um, I have kind of got to, um, you know, whatever, you know, once this run is over, I will, um, I will call it good. Because, you know, at that point, like, I've definitely shown a lot of stuff and you know, it should be enough to, um, 
hopefully encourage you to um, pick this title up for yourself because I mean honestly it's it's been um, it's been a great time. I do feel almost like a little bit invincible with, uh, I mean, my broom being so high powered, uh, you know, it does quite a bit of damage, uh, it does a great job cleaning. And I just, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm doing a really good job. Which, you know, honestly is good news because I kind of needed that kind of pick-me-up. Um, one of, like, my last uh, videos, uh, I wasn't really good at the game. Like, I, I'm not good at puzzle games. It's just a thing. And uh, the comments were, you know, pretty negative about how terrible I was. Which I get it, you know, people go to watch stuff to be entertained and whatnot, and if they go watch it and the person playing is just really terrible at something, uh, you know, maybe it's not so fun for them to, to watch, and so they want to complain about it. Totally get it. It's fine, but I ain't gonna lie, it hurt my feelings just a tiny bit. Um, so... Two hundred twenty percent extra. All right, uh, we'll do this. Uh, doesn't look like anything kind of upgraded for us. Uh, still no upgrades. Uh. We've unlocked like a bunch of places. I want to be in those places instead of um, you know, s the same places. I thought at first that um, you had to, um, you had to actually like kind of, uh, you know, do a new run, but um, no, I don't think so. It doesn't seem to be the case because the, um, I think it was the library. The library was uh, one of those locations that I unlocked through gameplay here and then it showed up for us, so. But it definitely feels a little bit... I don't know, it feels like that even though there's a lot of places that we unlock um, through gameplay, the game just uh, really doesn't want to, um, you know, actually give me access to these new locations. And I'm not really sure what's going on there. Like, those guys are all, like, on the other side of the wall. Doesn't feel like that's what's supposed to happen. I'm on fire? Jeez, okay, that's a new one. Hopefully that's not like a, you know, kind of permanent thing. No, it's not. So good news there. Pay to park. That's an... I don't know. It's not a new one. It's, I've been here before. Actually, no, this is a new place because um, I've never seen the trees before. Well, good. Maybe if I just keep talking about how I want the uh, new places to show up, maybe they'll actually show up more often. Man, I sure hope the next place is also a new place. Uh, I don't think that's how it works, but maybe we'll get lucky. The thing is, it's not even that like a, that big of a deal, um, you know, going to the new locations and everything, because the gameplay loop is the same every time, um, which I don't think is a bad thing, uh, because it is a very enjoyable gameplay loop in itself. There is uh, something rather enjoyable about the simplicity of it all.
I'm not sure, like, what's going on with these, uh, enemies being, like, stuck behind stuff. And I unlocked a new place. Uh, I wish I understood, like, what we needed to do in order to, like, unlock the new locations. Uh, it doesn't see... It, there, there seems to be, like, something that goes into it. There's some... Something that I'm doing that is, um... Kind of pulling it off, but I, I just, I just don't know what it is. Alright, let's, um... I guess, try this. I'll see, that like just doesn't do enough damage. Um... Oh, see, you know what? These guys, um... They did me dirty, man. Like... That's what I get for trying to, to do the client's request. You know, the uh, don't use the attack. I'm, I'm not bothering with that anymore. Those guys can just, they're just gonna have to get over it. Those clients will never be happy. Um, but I'm not gonna sacrifice my own safety for uh, the whims of, you know, their whims of fancy or whatever you, whatever you call it. I mean, trying to do what they wanted has made everything worse. Now I'm, I, I'm walking around, I'm cleaning, but the place isn't going to get that clean. It's going to be nice and stinky, and, um... It's just going to be uh, kind of how it is. going to keep that, um, but I guess it's more important to get a satisfied than uh, unsatisfied. And uh, to the surprise of no one, uh, there is no anti-stink this time around. Take minimal damage that I can do. It's like a flying goat thing or something. I don't actually know what it is. Um, took a little bit of damage, but I would say it's still under the minimal uh, context. like we unlocked, uh, or I, I don't know why I always say we, it's not like anybody else is here, uh, but I did unlock like something for, um, like valuable secrets or something, so I, I don't know what that exactly will entail, but I feel like it potentially will have its, um, kind of benefit, um, all right, so they, they, they saw right through my lie, but that's okay. So it looks like this is like, I mean, it it looks like you have a chance of, uh, of just kind of continually always just kind of, things are just always going to go up. You're not, you don't really ever have to kind of worry about um, getting a point to where you just aren't going to make any more money. So um, that's actually quite cool. It gives me um, a rather cool benefit of, um, you know, just doing all kind of stuff, I guess. I don't know, I have no idea what I was talking about. It's like I lost my train of thought uh, as I was saying that. For some reason, I, I, who knows? Kind of weird that I have to like 
use the brush uh, to um, kind of pull that off. You know, if he wasn't stinky, he'd probably be able to pull this off uh, to the point of actually cleaning everything to the point of um, actually getting spotless. But no, uh, the bonus, like, very rarely has deodorant. Patience thing. Eventually, eventually, I might get it. I don't know though. We will certainly see. Uh, I'm gonna lie about that again. Well, they still said no. This is why you're not supposed to lie, everybody. All right, I, I'm gonna do everybody a favor here, and I'm going to say that when I hit the two-hour mark, because obviously that's what I'm gonna do. I am going to stop at that point, um, and that will be the end of this video. Take zero damage, and we are at the watering hole, which, uh, this was a pretty cool place. I remember the first time I got here, and I was like, oh, look, it's a shark, because it has sunglasses, because, um, you know, that's how you know sharks are real. They have sunglasses, just like in the uh, Finding Nemo um, documentary about uh, what happens with clownfish. Uh... I think I'm both poisoned. I think I'm poisoned. Um, I'm poisoned and stinky. Oh, what a what a terrible what a terrible uh, oh god what a terrible day to be able to read. Oh, my stink is cured too. Oh, happy day! Like everything good is happening. Oh no 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 the the uh, the, th the thing I was uh, supposed to say is what a terrible day to have eyes. Um, I've heard that, like, twice or so? Uh, I don't know, it just seems like a rather humorous take on, um... You know, the ridiculousness of... You know, reading certain things, I guess. Well done, Mr. DiPaolo! Yeah, 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 I know. I know, I'm awesome sauce. Let's continue. I mean... I don't need to buy that. Don't use attack. Eh, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Failed immediately. Again, it's just, um, maybe as time goes on and I've unlocked more ways to uh, deal with the enemies uh, and cleaning and everything, it might make more sense, but it's just not worth it to me to um, kind of fulfill that request. So I, I just, I just, it's never gonna happen. Um, now I am gonna do like a, a, a more concise video because um, I know like not everybody's gonna sit here and watch a two-hour video of a guy walking around playing a Game Boy-esque uh, cleaning simulator, and I can't blame them. But um, I push the record button and, and and playing with a controller, I would have to take my hand off the controller and hit the mouse button, on, you know, in the second screen, and all these things that I would have to do to start recording. Um, and I'm having a good time, so I'm, I'm just, you know, I'm just going. But yeah, again, like, I do know that people sometimes don't have time for that, so I will have a, a more concise video, but if you've made it this far and you're like, oh, wait, wait, hold on, I didn't have to watch two hours of this, I could have just waited and watched something that was like 10 to 20 minutes, why didn't you just start with that? Because I didn't know I was going to do that until now. Uh, you know. Oh man, what? What? What even was that thing? Like, I definitely wasn't expecting that to be an enemy. Uh, not a big deal though. Not a big deal. Don't use defense. All right, I can do that. You know, some of these are, you know, actually pretty easy.
I feel like, um, as far as uh, lying about the, um, the secrets and stuff, I feel like it probably uh, isn't something that I would do too much. It's like, after you get it, like, the first time, uh, success, or once you unlock the poker face, um, upgrade, I think maybe it'll start making sense to use it at that point, like, a little bit more often. Up until then, um, I just, I don't think it would be something that I would, uh, recommend. It just doesn't seem worth it in the grand scheme of things, because you're not really getting a lot of cool stuff for, um, you know, lying about it. That's kind of how life is. Like, I mean, everything is better when you tell the truth, and you might say, well, there's sometimes it's worth it to tell lie. I don't think so, man. Just, just always tell the truth and be honest. People trust you. Uh, you know, it just seems like it'll be a better time uh, by all ways. Uh, and we got the Snugbug Hotel. I'm starting to think that unlocking locations is tied to f completing things uh, satisfactorily um, on some of these um, other locations. I just wish that, you know, again, I just wish that um, we were getting some of these other locations more often. I mean, the more you play, the better your odds are of, um, you know, I think, um, getting those hundred percent, uh, because you have you know, a little bit more skills, um, you know, like my broom is, uh, pretty, pretty powerful at this point. I've got a ton of spray if I wanted to use it, which I don't use because it just... I don't know, it just doesn't seem useful, and then the client didn't want me to spray, and I just used it for the dumbest reason. Uh, and that is just because I wanted to use the spray, because I just don't use the spray. Um, I mean, but it, obviously there is the benefit of using it in situations where you have, like, you know, multiple things that you could spray. Eh, light again, but... Yeah, it's whatever. I'm gonna do another one because, of course, we are. Uh, I'm gonna take the spinach. I'm gonna actually take all of these. Um, bargain beaters. Go swimming. I don't want to go swimming. Oh, but this is like a really cool one. All right, eh, whatever. Like, I, I, I feel like the company is doing a disservice to its employees if, I mean, even if I'm just a contractor, right? Um, you know, they have to know at this point that occasionally you get clients that are like, they know that you're, um, they have to know. I can't imagine they don't know, but, um, you know, they're telling your contractors to jump in water knowing that they can't swim, uh, you know, and risking their death for a little extra coinage or high ratings. It just, I, I just feel like the business is doing a real disservice and I'm a little bit uh, disappointed in them because what they should be doing is saying, I'm sorry, but you can never be, um, we're never going to do a contract with you again because you're um, putting our contractors at risk. But I mean... I should know better than to think that that would even be something that a company would um, consider because companies don't care. They will, um, it's all about money. Pikmin will damage, easy enough. I'm 
And yeah, I'm gonna lie about the, um... The case file again. I just, I feel like there's a chance, you know, that, like, maybe something... I mean, I did have the, um... One, uh, poker face unlocked. Which, you know, it's better than zero poker face unlocks, I suppose. But I, I don't know. Like, I feel like there's still, like, a chance that maybe something cool will happen. Um, again... Where are these, like, squid things coming from? Okay, I'm glad that the client still considered that uh, just a small amount of um, damage. Because uh, I, I, I took quite a bit, actually. Alright, so I'm going to do one more. Um... And then I will um, look at the upgrades that we've gotten so far. Oh, sweet, the circus. That's new, isn't it? I find it weird that the bee uh, stinks. Maybe it's a wasp. What is this guy? Oh, it's just like... Oh, alright, well apparently we can't actually go that way, so there's like a wall or something. today is popcorn. I think I'm like almost out of popcorn. Oh, I mean, it doesn't matter. All right, continue. We are going to go back and take a look at everything we've unlocked. Um, I mean, we, we made uh, $1,314, which is quite a bit. We've unlocked some conversation and some other stuff. Uh, some new sites, all kinds of stuff. Uh, it looks like, so after two almost two hours, I would say you have a pretty good chance of kind of unlocking almost everything. You do a work, excellent work, and new responsibilities, uh, so demands. I ain't too worried about that. They'll just be, um, you know, unhappy about that, I guess. Glimpse of Spotty. Alright, cool to unlock some new stuff. Like I said, I'm going to take a look at the uh, new upgrades, and then uh, that's where I'll end it. Uh, I feel like we've um, seen enough to, to kind of do well enough at, at on this particular video. Uh, let's see, that's all unlocked. Bathroom, uh, break room level 2. I don't really feel like I need that. It doesn't seem too important. Uh, that has been redeemed. That's been redeemed, redeemed. Heart heal plus, hearts heal 4 HP. Again, don't really think I need that one. Um, 20% chance of a successful lie. I am going to upgrade to that. Huh? Then we can uh, upgrade it again. 
um, to a 50% chance of successful live. But again, I don't actually see what that um, is really um, good. I don't ever clock out, clock out mid-site. Don't plan on ever doing that, so... Not gonna worry about this one. Uh, I've got this one. That, I think, is important. I think that is also important. I'm gonna get the all of them there. Ooh, 50% movement speed. Awesome sauce. Uh, let's see if it's... It just... It's actually better. Time saver. Ah, see, this is the one that I, I, I should have... I should have saved up a little bit to get the uh, valuable secret finder. That would have been good. I'm surprised that there's not, like, more... Um, upgrades over here. I mean, like, the mop is, like, one of the only other things. Um... I'm gonna take it, but I'm actually just really surprised that there's not more stuff for me to unlock. Or that I'm surprised that there's not more things that I could have unlocked. Oh, look, and some of these are like really cool. Look, I mean, inflict corrosion. Yeah, combustible. Yeah, I mean, all of those are those are good. I mean, they're layout upgrades, but whatever. So. There you go. That is a look at uh, Spotless. Highly recommended. It is it is ex an excellent uh, cleaning game. Um, been having a lot of fun with it. So the link is in the description. I encourage you to try it. Uh, thanks to sort of the developers for uh, hooking me up with a free key. And um, that's all I got.